And so we know and rely on the love God has for us. God is love. Whoever lives in love lives in God, and God in them. The season of Advent. And what does it mean when I hear love came down at Christmas? It's, it's a tough question. I mean, I could easily say, well, what it means is it was God's love that sent us his son at Christmas. That's kind of the easy way to answer it and just leave it there. But to me, it means the warmth that we all feel at this season as we come up to Christmas and suddenly everybody is feeling friendlier and kinder to each other and somehow we're infused with this warmth that we feel towards each other and our fellow man and certainly towards our family. Family at Christmas is, is so important to me. Christmas is my favorite season of the entire year. Always has been since I was a child and my dad made it the most special season going. So love is, is what I feel and my family feels and I feel towards my family and really what I feel towards everybody that I encounter whether I'm friends with them or even just someone on the street or someone who is in a lane and wants to get in and I let him in where maybe I wouldn't have at another time of the year. What I wish love meant when it came down at Christmas is very similar to a song that I sang recently, a carol that I sang at a concert just last week and it's called The Work of Christmas. And what it talks about is what happens after Christmas when the shepherds have gone back and the angels have gone back and now the work begins. And to me, that's what it means. We need to bring the love that we felt at Christmas and bring it through to the rest of the year. And if that was possible, well, I'll just leave it there. If that was possible, leave it up to you. Hi, I'm Sherry Ellis, and I sing with the Choir of St. Anne's. Love Came Down at Christmas is the first line of a beautiful poem composed by Christina Rossetti in 1885. What this line, Love Come, Came Down at Christmas, means to me is that God sent us a gift of love, a human baby that was wrapped in swaddling clothes and laid in a humble manger. God sent his son to live among us so that he could share his divine love with humankind. What God's gift of love means to me. The gift of light in the darkness. Christ is such a powerful symbol of light in the darkness. At this darkest time of the year, we bring light into our lives and homes by lighting candles, decorating Christmas trees with sparkling lights and a glowing Christmas star on the top. Christmas lights make me cheerful, but more importantly, Christmas day is the first day after the winter solstice where the day is perceptibly longer, only by about a minute, but it's perceptible. And it's a harbinger of more light to come. I also am thankful for the gift of love, of loving and being loved. I will be with my family on Christmas day and will follow our family traditions and share many hugs and laughs. At some point during the joyful chaos of Christmas day, I will take a peaceful time out and cuddle up with my five-year-old grandson in a big comfy chair to read Christmas stories. A glorious way to reflect on what is most important in my life. I wish you all God's peace and love.
Love came down at Christmas, love all lovely, love divine. Love was born at Christmas, star and angels gave the sign. Worship we the Godhead, love incarnate, love divine. Worship we our Jesus, but wherewith for sacred sign. Love shall be our token, love shall be yours, and love be mine. Love to God and to all humankind, love for plea and gift and sign.